I told you your first night wouldn't be a problem. You're a natural. Uh, by now I'm sure you've noticed the older models sitting in the back room. Uh, those are from the previous location, and we just use them for parts now. The idea at first was to repair them. Uh, they even started retrofitting them with some of the newer technology. But they were just so ugly, you know? And the smell. Uh, uh, so the company decided to just go in a whole new direction and make them super kid-friendly. Uh, those older ones shouldn't be able to walk around. But if they do, the whole Freddy head trick should work on them too. So, whatever. Uh, I love those old characters. Uh, did you ever see Foxy the Pirate? Oh wait, Foxy. Oh yeah, Foxy. Uh, hey listen, uh, that one was always a bit twitchy. Uh, I'm not sure if the Freddy head trick will work on Foxy. Uh, if for some reason he activates during the night, and you see him standing at the far end of the hall, uh, just flash your light at him from time to time. Those older models would always get disoriented with bright light. It would cause a system restart or something. Uh, come to think of it, you might want to try that on any room where something undesirable might be. It might hold him in place for a few seconds. Uh, that glitch might carry over to the newer models, too. Uh, one more thing. Don't forget the music box. I'll be honest, I never liked that puppet thing. It's always thinking, and it can go anywhere. Uh, I don't think the Freddy Mask will fool it, so just don't forget the music box. Um, anyway, I'm sure it won't be a problem. Uh, have a good night, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.
just to update you, uh, there's been somewhat of an investigation going on. Uh, we may end up having to close for a few days, I don't know. Uh, I want to emphasize, though, that it's really just a precaution. Uh, Bachelor Entertainment denies any wrongdoing. These things happen sometimes. Um, it'll all get sorted out in a few days. Just keep an eye on things, and I'll keep you posted. Uh, just as a side note, though, but try to avoid eye contact with any of the animatronics side of the camp. Uh, someone may have tampered with their facial recognition systems, we're not sure. But the characters have been acting very unusual, almost aggressive towards the staff. Uh, they interact with the kids just fine, but when they encounter an adult, they just stare. Uh, anyway, hang tight, it will all pass. Good night.
Squad 95. Um, hey, uh, keep a close eye on things tonight, okay? Uh, from what I understand, the building is on lockdown. Uh, no one is allowed in or out, you know. Especially concerning any previous employees. Um, when we get it all sorted out, we may move into the day shift. Uh, this is just the case. Available. Uh, we don't have a replacement for your shift yet, but we're working on it. Uh, we're gonna try to contact the original restaurant owner. Uh, I think the name of the place was Red Bear's Family Diner or something like that. It's been closed for years, though. I doubt we'll be able to track anybody down. Uh, so just get through one more night. Uh, hang in there. Good night.
doing there? Didn't you get the memo? The place is closed down, at least for a while. Someone used one of the suits. We had a spare in the back, a yellow one. Someone used it. Now none of them are acting right. Listen, just finish your shit. It's safer than trying to leave in the middle of the night. Uh, we have one more event scheduled for tomorrow, a birthday. You'll be on day shift. Wear your uniform. Stay close to the animatronic. Make sure they don't hurt anyone, okay? Uh, for now, just make it through the night. Uh, when the place eventually opens again, I'll probably take a night shift myself. Okay, good night and good luck. <laughs>